how to destroy acne. Um, so a lot of people think they can just eat raw food and the acne will completely go. This is pretty much true, but in the exception of fats, so and also other things like sleep, um, exercise, stuff like this. So exercise will move your lymphatic system and that will expel all the toxins. Um, sleeping, make sure you get enough sleep, regulate your hormones and things like that, so that'll completely stop it. Um, stop using all this shit on your face. Like, I don't use anything. I used to have really bad acne. I don't use anything. I haven't used shower products in, like, a year, maybe. And you don't need it, guys. Like, really. It's just going to do more harm than good. Um, yeah, with the fruit, if you're eating... I still am not 100% on this. Like, for example, I can eat durian, as much durian as I want, and get no pimples, even though that's got fat. Maybe if I ate a shitload, I probably would. Um... But then it comes to like coconut meat, and I eat one coconut meat, and I get pimples the next day, or a few pimples. And I think it's to do with the omega balances of the fats, certain ratios and things like that. But I have heard that you can overcome uh, your intolerance to things like that. Like for example, my coconut intolerance. Um, if I just cut it out for a while, for say six months or whatever, and then come back to it, it you can actually... Your body is then able to absorb it. I got some mango on my lips. Ate some mango here. Two mangoes before I work out. And yeah, uh, so sleep, exercise, sunlight is really good. It cleans your skin. It actually cleans your skin from bacteria and things like this. And also just just washing the toxins off your skin because when you're detoxifying, all these toxins come out and they they sit on the top of your skin. So they sit like here and whatever. And then you need to sort of just rinse them off once every every evening. You come back from wherever you've been. You might have some oil as well from the pollution and things. You just want to quickly wash that off with... You can use cold water, whatever. And yeah, that's if you do these things, lower your fat intake while, you, while you're getting rid of it. And then you can start to, start to experiment. I'm going to start to experiment with the coconut meat now that I've completely cleared mine. And I'll let you guys know what happens. But um, yeah, so keep the fats to a minimum. Just eat fruit, any fruit. You can eat dates, you can eat, like, well, I remember when I started, I was like, oh, a date, that's so much concentrated sugar, that'll give me heaps. But you can eat anything, guys. So, yeah, um, keep the fat low, get enough sleep, eight hours plus. You should really sleep until you wake up. Like, if that's 12 hours, if that's 13 hours, sweet. Um, so, exercise, too, to get the lymph moving, and wash the toxins off at the end of the day, and stop using shit on your face. Yeah, that's it, guys. Um, and then after that, like, I used to think, oh, if I touch my face or if I lie on my pillow, I'll get a pimple. But now uh, I can do anything, really. I never have to worry about that stuff, and I never get it. So it really does come down to the food is a big, big factor. So, yeah, keep the fats low, all that. Peace.